Hey guys and gals, it's your buddy the Texan Detective. And with the holiday season coming up, your buddy was thinking, hmm, a lot of people are going to be upgrading their detectors for Christmas. Yep, a lot of people may be getting their first detector for uh, Christmas. And if that's you, welcome to the hobby. You're going to be addicted. You're going to be a dirt digger like me. Well, I was thinking, when I first got my detector, something I did to help me learn my detector, because I don't care how much money you spend on a detector, if you don't know what those beeps and those numbers mean, you are not going to enjoy the hobby. You're, or you're gonna, you may enjoy the hobby, but you're not going to enjoy it as much as if you knew what all the information your detector's giving you. Because we have some pretty nice detectors these days. My MX Sport, it is amazing. I've been using it for a couple years now and I still think I haven't even scratched the surface because I found what works for me in the situations I detect. As I detect other situations, I have to adjust and figure out what works there. But today I'm gonna do a little instructional video. It's gonna be a little short video on how you can learn your detector at home. All right, stay tuned. All right, well, I'm behind my garage right now trying to stay out of the wind. And while I'm back here, look at these beautiful horses I get to look at every day. They're not mine, but they are some beauties back here. But anyway, back to the lecture at hand. Now, the first thing you're gonna do is take you a nice towel and set it on the, on the ground here. Then you're gonna wanna get some random targets here. A couple good, a couple bad. We're gonna start off with this big gold ring. We're gonna set it right there. And then we're gonna take this silver ring and we're gonna set it right there. And let's, here, let's, something different. Let's go with this buffalo nickel. We're gonna set it right there. Then you're gonna take another towel here and you're gonna cover cover your targets see just like that now I'm gonna grab the MX Sport there here let's go ahead and grab it turn on your MX Sport Just what it rang up when I dug it, a 42. See that high, 79. And Buffalo Nickel always reads this a tad low. The Clad ripper, Nickel will read 20. Now you can repeat this process as needed. You also want to get targets you don't want to do. You want to throw some bottle caps under there. You want to throw some pull cap tabs under there. Matter of fact, give me a second. I'm going to reset this up and I'm going to do an example with some non desirable targets. Okay, stay tuned. Okay, now I got this set up with some uh, non desirable targets. Let's see what happens. Well, heck. That is your dreaded bottle cap. That is a uh, rusted iron nut. And anybody who uses the MX Sport knows if you get a solid 22, you got a 98% chance of it being, hold on, dun, 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 a pull tab. Now, this is a really fun way to learn your detector. You can do it at home without digging a whole bunch of holes in your yard. I know a lot of people like to have a test garden in the yard, and I, I respect that. But this is a way you can do it and be flexible. You can change your targets. You can put a rusty nail next to a silver quarter and see what it sounds like. You can do all, I mean, just get creative. The more you play with it, the more you learn. Uh, another thing I've done, I've taken, uh, let me put my detector down. 
I've taken, let's say, a bag of sand or a bag of pot and soil and put on top just to simulate dirt. You know, I mean, it's 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 just all learning your detector. Something you can do at home. You got a few minutes. You're bored. You want to go detecting. You don't have time, but you got 20 minutes. Get out in your yard. Learn your detector. Now that's the tip for today. Learn your detector. Detector 101. Learn that detector. All right, well, this is the Texan Detector signing off. I just thought I'd share a little bit of uh, knowledge with y'all. Uh, a lot of y'all may have already thought of this. Those who haven't might think it's a really good idea. I hope it helps, and I hope you get out there and learn your detector and get to digging. Happy hunting and stay dirty. Because if we ain't getting dirty, we ain't finding nothing. If we ain't finding nothing, I don't know about you, but I ain't having no fun. <laughs> All right, until next time.